if anything would have happened to her or worse, I don't know what I would have done. Jasmine Villalobos fights through the tears. I mean, I was just hoping my nephew was okay. Monday night, Jasmine got an unexpected call from her pregnant sister, Jessica. She was crying. She was, you could hear everything going on. She was like... We just got hit by a semi. I think my leg's broken. Without a second thought, Jasmine rushes to the scene. Then I saw my nephew's car seat on the floor. My brother-in-law, he was covered in blood. Officials say a semi truck turned right in front of Jessica's car. He realized he had gotten lost and wanted to turn around. He went onto the shoulder and then attempted to make a U-turn across four lanes of traffic apparently without signaling or putting his hazard lights on. Causing a three-car collision. And some of the ve vehicles became wedged under the trailer. Hurting several people in the process. Jasmine saying the scene was brutal. I mean, by the look of the cars and the way the accident was, like, I don't know how they lived through it. Paramedics flew her sister Jessica to UMC. She was in labor. They drilled a rod into her femur to hold her femur into place so she could give birth. The family later welcoming a healthy baby boy. Jasmine says it was the second miracle this week. I just want her to be able to look back and see like God was had his hand upon their life like they definitely have a purpose here because if not like who knows what else could have happened like they're definitely still needed on this earth. She named her baby boy Jason, and they're doing fine tonight. Police say the semi-truck driver was cited for not signaling and making an improper turn.